The Weather Extreme video. This is for Friday, November 27th. I'm James Spann. Alabama's weather stays very comfortable through tomorrow. A big mess to the west. Maybe some rain moving into extreme north Alabama Sunday. This is where we are this morning. Big trough in the western states producing big problems west of Alabama this morning. Check out the numbers here. Mostly 50s. Birmingham at 58. We'll expect a high at or over 70 in most spots again today. But around the region, you can pick out that cold front between Little Rock and Tulsa. Little Rock at 64, Tulsa at 37. Cold air diving down into Oklahoma, parts of West Texas, the Texas Panhandle, where they've got some icing problems. And deeper back in the cold air, temperatures are actually below zero this morning over parts of Montana and Wyoming. Welcome to winter. On the uh, watch warning map, winter storm Warnings for parts of Kansas, New Mexico, and the far tips of the uh, Oklahoma and Texas Panhandle. An ice storm warning for the rest of the Texas Panhandle, the Texas South Plains, up into parts of West Oklahoma. And on the other side of the front, you got a flash flood watch in effect from near Waco and Dallas Fort Worth up to St. Louis. It's kind of a peek at the uh, radar early this morning. You can see the progression there with rain over North Texas changing to freezing rain over the panhandle and snow back in the northwestern tip of Texas, up around uh, Dalhart. And uh, thankfully, that mess will stay west of the state in the short term. Rain for the next five days, how about eight inches on the Oklahoma-Texas-Arkansas line, the Arklatex region there. And this is valid through Wednesday morning of next week, and you can see a huge gradient across uh, Alabama. This is actually suggesting they're near the Tennessee border. They could pick up two inches of rain there. But then you drop off to Birmingham. The numbers come way down. But no doubt we'll start to see some rain early next week. And again, the, the far northern part of the state might begin to see the rain on Sunday. Here's a higher look at the uh, rain forecast in the short term. This is valid through Sunday evening. And again, the big numbers to the west. And of course, this is the biggest problem, the ice this is the projected ice accumulation through through the weekend, and that's just nasty. Uh, Lubbock, Texas, up into uh, Oklahoma, an area south and west of Oklahoma City, and then up into parts of Kansas, where some of the highways could be skating rinks. So travelers, beware. All right, uh, model fans, here we go. The GFS, this is the 06C run, valid today at noon. There's your big trough in the west. Got a nice 588 ridge here. For us, we're expecting highs around 70. Mix of sun and clouds, no rain. Rain from Texas to the eastern Great Lakes and snow and ice back in the colder air behind the front. Tomorrow we stay dry and again, a good chance we see highs around or just above 70. And the sky probably will feature more clouds than sun with that rain not that far away. And again, rain from Texas up into Ohio and Pennsylvania. And the ice continues over West Oklahoma and the Texas Panhandle. Now, Sunday, the rain begins to creep into North Alabama. The better chance of rain Sunday, north of U.S. 278, north of a line from Hamilton to Cullman to Gadsden. Uh, the chance of rain relatively small for Tuscaloosa, Birmingham, and Anniston. And for Sunday, the high probably dropping back a little bit, not much in the upper 60s. Monday, same thing. The, the main chance of rain stays up there uh, over the northern quarter of the state. The southern two-thirds of the state dry. The high Monday would be still well up in the 60s. And this is Tuesday. And really, it's the same thing. Uh, and I could see where we might see some decent rain amounts uh, north of Cullman. If this all verifies, where if you're in Birmingham, you won't see much at all. Wednesday, that front really never passes through here. Uh, but cool air should begin to creep in. Highs may be dropping back in the 50s. And again, some chance of rain over north Alabama. Thursday, a wave on the front. Maybe a chance of rain statewide. And I'll just say we, we've had very low confidence, or we have a very low confidence opinion of next week's forecast because of model inconsistency. Almost every run looks different. And this is a week from today, Friday, the 4th of December, troughing overhead and the rain begins to move out. So during the week next week, we'll see rain around, but the better chance, obviously, early in the week will be over the northern quarter of the state. This is the end of the forecast period, Sunday, December 6th, troughing axis a little to the east, and we are dry and cool if this verifies. You can see the warmth in the short term. 
And then we start to cool down by the end of next week with highs dropping back in the 50s and lows dropping into the 30s. That's it for the Weather Extreme video today. We'll have notes on the blog. We're on the holiday schedule, so one video per day today. Back to the two-a-day schedule on Monday. Brian Peters, the man that looks like Colonel Sanders. We'll have the video updates here tomorrow and Sunday. If you can't catch us this evening, ABC 3340 News will be on this evening two times at 6 and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great weekend and God bless.